Hello and welcome to my trailer reaction for Midnight Sun. Now this is directed by Scott Spear who previously directed a little movie called Step Up Revolution. So, you know, my, my, my thoughts on this already is, is, is pretty tarnished, but you know, everyone's got to start somewhere. But I think this movie has two things going for it. Number one, it's based on a Japanese film, so I can't wait to see if there's any whitewashing controversy coming out of it. Um... But also, uh, it's, it's, uh, it stars Arnold Schwarzenegger's son. So, um, look, I've got, like, no, um, expectations, but, you know, it does have an actor in it called Rob Riggle, uh, which I'm actually, I just got my phone here. Um, look, this, this, this dude, he, I just don't like him. He's literally the exact same character and his improvisation skills are absolutely terrible, and it shows in every single movie he's in. But anyway, I'm not going to let him tarnish the work of thousands of people who worked on this production. So, um, oh, by the way, uh, someone asked me why I, why I always say, um, right, here yeah, now. Um, the reason why I make that little sound is because I'm when, it, when I'm editing the trailer into these videos, I use that as like some kind of cue to make sure that the trailer syncs up with the, with, with the sounds from the, anyway, um, it's just, yeah, it's something which I did once and now I just can't stop doing. So, uh, anyway, let's watch this trailer right now. I have this reoccurring dream. I feel the warmth of the sun on my skin and the comfort of arms around me. And I want to stay there forever, but that would be impossible. I have a severe sensitivity to sunlight. Doctor appointments became a part of my routine. It's not going to fall into remission, and every year the risk becomes more serious. So I spend all my time indoors, behind special windows, sleeping during the day and staying up all night, and playing music. Mm, sign every fan. chance oh. I get. So I'll keep re Hey. Uh, what should I have said? Hey. I'm Katie Price. I've watched you outside my window for the past 10 years, and I've been in love with you, stalking you every minute. This is what Taylor Swift does. She has awkward interactions with boys, and then she just writes amazing songs about it. I don't understand how we've never met. I've probably skated by your house every day on the way to practice. Hey, you wouldn't want to do something sometime, would you? I'm really busy during the day, but I could be free at night. <laughs> what does Katie Price want to do? There's so many things I want to do. First live show. That was literally one of the best things ever. Right? You coming? I am not comfortable with him not knowing. I'm going to. I just need a little longer of being someone more than just a disease. This isn't something you can just not tell me. I'm so sorry. But we're not the couple who doesn't try it. <coughs> eh. I don't think I'm the target audience for this film. It's like uh it's like Fault in Our Stars, except uh she's allergic to the sun. Um uh instead of being allergic to uh living like the kids from Fault in Our Stars. Look, I'm not gonna see this movie. Um, I'll only see it if I get a press screening for it, and even then I'll go begrudgingly, so. Um, yeah, I, I, yeah, it's just, it's, it's just not my kind of movie. Um, but, you know, I'll watch, I'll watch anything, like, if it's on Netflix and I accidentally click on that instead of something that I actually want to watch, I'll, I'll probably won't, I'll probably give it, like, 20 minutes. Um, but yeah, it's just not really, it's just not really my thing. Um... Already, I can tell that they're gonna they're, they're gonna fall in love in the first act, 
And then in the second act, it's all about them discovering each other. And then right towards the end of the second act, he finds out that, like, she's got the disease and stuff. And she thinks that, like, oh, my God, like, he's totally, like, uh, not going to love me anymore. And then he will forgive her. And then, bam, they live happily ever after. Like, it's just... I've seen this movie, like, ten times before, so... Uh, anyway, um, let me know what you thought down in the comments below. And, uh, and of course, if you like this video and want to see more, please click here to see more. Thanks for watching. Bye.